This tutorial is powered by AskQuesty.com. Get help with your website on demand. And don't forget, subscribe for more tutorials. How to use the if is page WordPress conditional statement. So here's how to use it. Navigate to your WordPress website and then head over to dashboard. On the left hand side, go down to an appearance and navigate to theme editor. Inside a theme editor, scroll down until you find this single page, so page.php. And this page modifies the th this page is responsible for handling a single page on the WordPress website. So what we're going to do is over here in the PHP code, you can put this anywhere, but I'll as long as it is within the PHP tags, right? This is a starting PHP tag, and this is an ending PHP tag. So anything between the starting PHP tag and the ending PHP tag is a valid place to put this bit of code that I'll show you. Starting PHP tag, the ending PHP tag uh, doesn't show up yet, but anyway, I'll show you what I mean. How to use the is page, uh, the is page conditional statement. So here I'll say if is page contact, then I want you to print out yes, it is contact page. And then if it's not the contact page, if a page is not a contact page, then print out no, it, no, not contact page. Then click save. So now let's see the effect of this code. So when we reload a page, you'll notice that over here it says, no, not contact page, right? Because it makes, it checks to make sure that the page is the contact page. So over here, it on the URL bar, it's not a contact page. If you head over to projects, this is projects, not contacts. So that's why it still says no, not contact page. But when you head over to contact, where at the top, it actually is the contact page. Then it says, yes, it is contact page, right? Because if you were to type contact, this actually is the contact page. So any page where it is not the contact page, it'll display no, it is not the contact page. And, 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 and for the contact page where it actually is the contact page, it'll say yes, it is a contact page. So this is how you use the is underscore page conditional. It can help you check what the current page is. Thanks for watching. If this was helpful, please subscribe. And if you need extra help, visit AskQuesty.com and send us your questions.